Commitment. Making a commitment involves dedicating yourself to something. In sports, you dedicate yourself to your task, training, and team. Before you make a commitment, think carefully. A commitment obligates you to do something. There is a difference between interest and commitment. When you're interested in doing something, you do it only when it's convenient. When you're committed to something, you accept no excuses, only results. Willingness to sacrifice. Commitment means you knowingly and willingly give up things you might want in the short term to potentially gain something of greater value in the long term. In a team setting, commitment also means sometimes sacrificing your individual goals for good of the team. The on commitment that I really like. Commitment is the glue that bonds you to your goals. Without commitment, you can't reach your goals. Okay, lessons in commitment for youth sports. Number one, resisting the urge to quit. Number two, understanding the value of time. And number three, accepting the importance of teamwork. Not quitting takes a lot of life experience that kids don't have. Most of them struggle to overcome that instinctive, in-the-moment urge to quit. It doesn't just happen in youth sports either. Sometimes you see it when your child is doing schoolwork or playing video games or cleaning their rooms. Uh, for those of you that teach at the middle school or younger level, uh, you can relate to this. Um, kids, a lot of times kids that go out for teams when they find it difficult and run into hard times, you know, the practices are difficult or they don't have success right away, they um, take the easy way out and quit a lot of times. Understanding the value of time. Teaching kids about commitment also teaches them the value of time. Success does not occur overnight. It's an ongoing process. Okay, this is another good point. Uh, a lot of times kids will come in. Uh, I deal with uh, students that are a lot of times very low skilled at a low skilled level but those that continue working and stick it out often succeed and and sometimes even become starters by the eighth grade when in the sixth grade they were you know started from the bottom accepting the importance of teamwork when you are part of a team you lose some semblance of individualism you cannot be there on the field or court for your investment only Learning commitment to a team, not just your own individual desires, is a hard lesson for kids to learn. Here's a good, good graphic. There are only two options regarding commitment. You're either in or you're out. There's no such thing as life in between. Pat Riley. In conclusion, commitment is a characteristic that is made up of several components, including perseverance, investment, and teamwork. Success will come if you don't quit, work hard, and sacrifice individual goals for team goals. I focused on the uh, perseverance, investment, and teamwork because that's uh, what I notice uh, most when I deal with uh, students at the age level that I teach and coach. The perseverance, uh, a lot of times um, the kids have to work at that because it's easy to quit when things don't go well. The investment, that's the practice time, uh, and also practicing on their own. And teamwork, working with others and uh, not being selfish. So that's, that's it for my presentation. I hope you enjoy it. enjoyed it. Thank you.